Hey, Sean Mathis here with Success Series. And today I've got my first lender ever on this series, uh, Michelle Castle with Guild Mortgage. She's branch manager here in DFW area. She serves from Waxahachie all the way into Oklahoma. She's even licensed in Oklahoma. And the reason I've got Michelle on today is she's actually the number one loan officer in Texas for Guild Mortgage, and she's top 2% in the country. That's amazing. There's over 500 loan officers in her company. So Michelle, what's helped you reach the top here with all the lenders in Texas? How have you reached such levels of success? Um, I think uh, the fact that I don't take no for an answer, I'll always find a way to get a yes. Even if I can't help someone, I'll find someone that can give them a yes. But we do a lot of loans that the lenders that other lenders turn down, and I love that because you know you got you got buyers and sellers that at, at the end of, of a transaction they think they're fixing to move, and all of a sudden their loan gets turned down by another lender. So we get to come in a lot of times and um, make the loan work and get buyers and sellers you know moving into their new homes. Um, and then communication I think is real key. Uh, we all have to communicate together. We work together as a team. Everybody needs to be on the same page at all times. And so it's really important for us from the time that we take a loan application till the time that they close and fund and they get the keys to their new house. We're going to talk to everybody involved in that transaction throughout the entire transaction so that everybody's on the same page. Awesome. Whether it's the insurance agent, you in many right. cases, um, title companies, the, the agents involved, both agents involved. And I think that's that's uh, a big part of our success. It really is. And I, I work with a lot of lenders um, where I get my business. And I can't tell you how many times I've had customers who are buying a house asking me when their closing date is. Um, and that, you just that's you can't have it. Right, you yeah. can't have it. There's got to be communication. So uh, it sounds so fundamental, but there are so many people who, who don't do that. And I think it's awesome that you have that uh, communication and everybody involved. Well, and it's a system put in place. So it's not something that's just done on occasional deals. Everybody in my office knows from the time that we get that loan that their job is to communicate every step of the way. So everybody in our office knows where that transaction is, where in the process it is, because we all communicate with each other in, on an ongoing basis. That way we can relay that information to all the parties in the transaction. And you've been in the business a long time. How long have you been doing this? Michelle? 20 years. 20 years. So you get a lot of referrals from repeat clients, but also a lot of new new purchase from realtors mm -hmm. because of those that communication line. Mm -hmm. The systems. And I know what's important to a lot of realtors is um, closing on time. I know I hear that all the time. from I, I need somebody that can close deals on time. And um, I, I rarely have to adjust the closing dates, uh, if ever, for you guys. How, how are you guys able to do that when other lenders seem to constantly be pushing dates back. Well, and one thing, it, it still goes back to communication. You've got to tell a customer at the very first, if, you know, if they don't get their paperwork to us on time, then it could delay the closing. Mm -hmm. So it has to start with, again, communication. You've got to communicate to the, to the, um, to the buyer yeah. what, they're, what, what we expect of them in order for them to, to know what, or to be confident that what they're expecting from us they can happen. Right. Same thing with the real estate agents. And there are times that you get some um, transactions that are falling a little bit behind because you got an, you know, you got inspection issues um, and, and somewhere a little bit delayed in, in ordering appraisals. But again, it's all communication. So whenever you do have those delays, you do got to communicate it to all parties of the transaction so that everybody knows what the expectations are. So if there's any realtors watching or, or any lenders who, who need someone when they can't get a deal done to refer to, how can folks get a hold of you? Um, I'm easy. You can text and you can, I respond to text messages, message me on social media, emails, phone calls. Um, I'm easily available. My office number is 903-771-2617. They can, anybody at the office can always find me, and um, my number is tied to my cell phone, so I'm available evenings and weekends when needed. What about a website for online apps? Website is michellecastle.com. Awesome. Thank you.